In this experiment, we are going to investigate whether temperature affects the activity of the enzyme catalase. The enzyme is found inside the liver tissue and we have equal parts or equal sized bits of liver ready to put into hydrogen peroxide, 10 ml in each of these measuring cylinders that have been in the water baths for half an hour at 20, 40, 60 and 80 degrees. I'm going to try to quickly put one piece of liver into each measuring cylinder and we're going to look at the volume of froth produced. Before I do that though, I'm going to very quickly um, make sure that I have detergent in. I have already put detergent in. Um, I've reminded myself by finding my pipette. So I'm now going to put my liver into each in turn, hopefully it'll go right down into the middle. So 20 degrees. Forty degrees. Sixty degrees and eighty degrees. If we return to the experiment after five minutes, we can see that measuring cylinder that was has Hydrogen peroxide at 40 degrees is still um, producing oxygen gas, therefore we have a, an overflowing measuring cylinder with froth. 20 degrees and 80 degrees, would that be expected ex um, experimental results? I'm going to leave that one you know, with you as a thought. Which temperature does the enzyme work best? Therefore, what has happened to the enzyme at 80 degrees and at 20 degrees?